Okay, so I figured I would do a quick tutorial on how I just played that. So super simple, I like to use intervals, right? So on acoustic guitar, it's fun to use intervals because you have a lot of open strings that you can play with. So for that song, it starts on E minor. So what you're doing, you're doing first finger on the seventh fret on the fifth string, which is the A string. And then the pinky is on the second string or the B string right here. And it's on the eighth fret. So that's the interval of E minor. You can just play that interval using those two strings, or you can play an open chord. So it's a really cool open chord. Um, it's an interval. Um, so it's an E minor, we'll call it. Then I slide down to C on the bass note on the fifth string with my first finger. And we're gonna space it out instead of here where it's one fret apart, we're gonna do two frets apart. So on the fifth string, I'm sorry, on the second string, fifth fret, we're gonna use the pinky and that's gonna be a C chord. You can play it like that or you can just do the two. Okay, and then you're gonna slide it all the way up here. We're gonna go to, let's see, 10th fret with the first finger and the pinky is again going to be two frets apart so on the 12th fret on the B or second string and that's going to be a G chord so you have a G and a B okay so it's actually thirds that you're playing here okay and then you're going to go to a D here so fifth fret first finger fifth string and then the Pinky is going to be on the seventh fret on the B string or the second string. So that's a D. Very fun intervals to play within this uh, key of G here. So E minor, C, G, D. And you can play around with some more stuff. You can do G, A minor seven. Okay, A minor seven is the twelfth and the thirteenth. So the 12th fret with the first finger and the 13th fret on the B string, pinky. So you can play around a lot of different stuff. So it's a really fun progression to play with. So I encourage you, check it out. Um, acoustic guitar, a lot of it's very simple, but it's making simple things sound great. So hope you enjoyed this uh, brief tutorial here and uh, let me know if you have questions on what else to play.